Hello there, guys. <clears throat> Welcome to another episode of my gang. Yeah. And today we're going to talk about, yes, the kings of the West Highland lines. The K-Force. Hello there, would be. <laughs> oh, oh um, uh, hi, PT. Oh, uh, hello. I heard that you have frustrated, but you're not cross. I'm not. No, I'm not. No, 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 you did it yourself. Oh, um, uh, hi, AH Rails. Yeah, it's not. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yes, um, yes. Hey, hey PD, want to see something cursed? Yes. Look what happened to Thomas. What the hell? What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> hey guys. Hello. Wait, so fast? I haven't seen you in ages. How you doing? I'm doing good. Uh, Thomas broke. That's weird. Thomas, Thomas dead. Broke. Um, let's just say, um, I got into the scrapyards again, and I, um, <clears throat> I retired Jeez. again, so, I, they're Jeez, just gonna use me for freaking spare parts again. Oh, okay, geez. I hope you get yeah. better, so right, right, right. Yeah. Yes. Right, right, now, right, now gonna, right now, we're gonna talk about Tom ourselves, is. yes, the case yes. to the West Island Lines, the London mm -hmm. Northeastern Railway, Class K4. Oh yeah, the class K four. K fours. Fun fact: I'm actually um. Hello, PD Hernandez. Yep. Remember me? <laughs> John, uh, yes. yes. Oh, as you know. This is K four. So you can see there. This is in so production started in 1937 when chief mechanical engineer at the time, Sir Nigel Grassley, decided to build some of these greatest okay. mixed traffic engines to tackle. Don't the ask my system. user. Yeah, and so, but the result is this one. Unlike the the K threes at the time, it, the boilers are a bit longer because they have two pilot wheels at the front, but also oh, they I'm have actually... extended. Wait, some... this is what it would look like. Dang. Wait, this and is what so, it would look like if Thomas's O face. Bruh. And this is a a is a locomotive it has a footplate. Just like the, mm -hmm. like the P17s or another, like the P49s. But also, it has mean, a I mean, right here. And that's the final right here. I mean, like... And also, I oh, oh, LPS is here. Oh, LPS, hi. Oh, shoot. Remove yeah. Donovan, remove Donovan. Yeah, I dare you. Uh, I don't wait. dare you. Remove him. Wait, 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 wait. Not shot! No, no, not Look shot. At this guy's. What the heck? Wow. <laughs> Yay! Whoa. I'm original. <laughs> what is? What is that thing? <laughs> that is supposed to be Beast Fast from so or Portland Fallout that I'm making. It's basically, uh, it's terrifying. But it's funny being at mutated, the same time. basically. <laughs> It's you funny. Have a lot of it. Let me just say something. It's funny, <laughs> but in a good this, way. It's in tenor shot. <laughs> Look what I did. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh my god. Yes. Yes. Yo, what? Yeah. Yes. Is that the original Shrek? And also, when you look on my screen, it's oh, 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 and nobody oh, oh, likes him. Raiden right of the Unstoppable. Guys, look at this. Whoa. He got, oh, oh, he got that. Hold on. He got that orange smoke, though. Wendy, Wendy, remember yes. the Barney avatar you used? Oh, my what? God. Remember the Barney avatar you used? I don't have it on me right now because I'm on another account. <laughs> I made myself as a ship, by the way. Why does that remind me of uh, Donovan for some That reminds me of Donovan for some reason. Yep, Donovan told me to become a ship, so shoot, I'm a ship. I'm not really the biggest fan of Donovan, to be honest. And uh, I made myself as AC9. Yes. yes. Anyway, let's get back to the story about the K-Force. Let's get back to the story. And to this point, the K-Force are the needed some um, to tackle the West Highland. And so, yeah. The K anyway, let's go back to the topic of the K-Force. 
Shall what we? If I, um, hold on. What if I? So the K Force are the needed some of these big engines to go to the West Highland line. So if you wanted the attention, the biggest and just to pick it around, this engine has the bigger engine. The K Force needed to tackle the steep grades over the Highland line. Wait, wait. Dang. Oh, so yes. Anyway, the K if you want to see a K4 to do that, the LNER has a bigger engine for the bigger jobs. And mm. yes. So the tackle nice. is on. Yeah. Huh. Sorry about that. I kind of uh... sorry. Okay, so we have the engine stocking up. That's good. I see. That's it. Okay, so guys, so uh, yes, the K force. Yes, it's just around here. Ah, uh, so I did something brutal to Steven. Actually, you might want to share my screen and see what happened. Because this was a violent accident. <sighs> Let's just say that <laughs> Steven collided into the back of my passenger train and boom. He now in coma. <laughs> wait, wait. Whoa! 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 <laughs> wait, 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 guys. <clears throat> Steven, what the heck just happened? Did you seriously crash into the back of my oh, passenger train? Oh, we got a train? three printer. <laughs> yeah. Wow. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Oh, he said JK. Dude. Wait. I don't know why, but the way that I make Steven, though, yeah. this is crucial, man. This is crazy. Yes, but... Oh. <laughs> oh, wait. <clears throat> I know what I'm doing. So, yes, but um, yes, anyway, so the London K4 force are usually to use to pull some of these edges all, all the way for the West Highland line. All the, na all the names of the K4 force were named after some of these Scottish. Oh, you're not gonna do it now? There you go. <laughs> yep. Also, and so, yes. Uh, 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 sorry, it's one, one, too one, laggy. One. It, uh, so laggy. Don't go. Uh, try, try to rejoin. Try to rejoin. Yeah. No, 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 no. I was saying. I got. I got. A, <laughs> all the I got a message the for you. Oh, I got a message oh, for you. Oh, I got a message for you. I got a message for you. Listen, I haven't told you this, but Mark is. <laughs> If no one interrupted me, that would have, I would have explained what Mark is doing. What, what what's going on? on? What's going on? Mark, uh, don't, ask. don't ask. Don't so fast. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I will sorry. call you. All right. I want to explain this, but Mark is doing something very bad. Say what? Yeah, I mean taking over, taking over the world. Pardon? Yeah, he's actually taking over the world. That means me, me, and the all the other. Did look not. who's here? There, there he is. Well, well, well. Look who's here. The little oh, saddle tank engine himself. The little, the little, the little. Yes, little Percy is. the saddle tank engine ripoff. <laughs> Really? And so, yes. So, anyways, back to the kid. Yes, yes, yes. 
Petey, you got to seriously kick Mark off the series for doing a heinous crime. To be honest, I think uh, you should probably really? kick out. Tra I think you should probably kick out Train Fan out of the series because um, Claire, he's done a some, he should he should he's done some terrible stuff. Yeah. Also, does anyone know about my out. voice? No, no, voice. not me, not me, not me. Bad uh, Mark. Not bad, 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 not bad. Me. Let me explain. Let me explain, yeah. Petey. Let me explain. The reason why I'm wanting you to kick out Mark of the group <clears throat> chat because he's actually, he's actually trying to take over the world. In what way? I don't know what you mean. Making by me that. and Brayden fall. When oh, I, when really? we also have life, we have family, we don't just die. <sighs> oh, God. Yeah, this is getting crazy, guys. Mark, if you're going to keep doing the right. same shenanigans, let's just continue show. about the K Force, shall we? Right. Yes, all, the names, all the names of the K Force were named after the Scottish Highlanders. The I uh, know names that. Long, Marquess, the Cameron of Lockyer, Lord of the Isles. McLean, Kalen Moore, and McLeod of McLeod. All, all of them are being, are being built between 1937 and 1939, making a total of six of these engines. Damn. Fast forward to the 1940s. All these out. engines. Petey, you're glitching yeah. out. Yeah, it's going to go to a little bit. No, I'm glitching out because uh, it's too late. Alright, let me explain. Let me explain. Let me explain, let me explain why I want to kick out Mark of the series. So let me explain the reasons why I'm thinking about kicking out Mark from your series, including Diego's. What's uh, here? Okay. Slowly taking over the world. That means I'm slowly starting to fade out of existence. I am utterly confused. So, after that war, Mark is Nothing. mad at me just because me and Brayden act like freaking children. That's what I'm going to say. They think he thinks I act like children when I'm actually defending myself from him. You were confronting Bra Brayden and Mark. <laughs> Thing. Can I talk, please? Sorry about that. Oh, yes. Yeah. All right, so, like, just to put ourselves back on track, well, um, mm. like, so, <clears throat> like, it's just a wee bit more history on the K4s. Yeah. So, the prototype K4 number 3441 left Darlington, well, it left for Darlington East Field Depot on Glasgow in Glasgow on the 20th of January 1937, after five weeks yes. of crew training and being confined to good work, it made its debut on a passenger train in March 4. And um, the K-4s were definitely one of the more powerful moguls the um, the LNER had. And in 19 and these things actually managed to survive into British Railways days. Yes. Most of them were painted in British Rail Black. Yeah, 1948. When British Rail was nationalized, yeah, yeah, they and were so sort of the stenches have been painted all BR colors, all not painted. We know that because they were Funny. the same paint scheme. Yeah. Actually, all of like them every engine you know, has to wear BR all black. All painted black itself. So yeah, yeah, like that, like that. That's what I'm oh, talking geez. about. Black. There's too oh, much oh, BR oh, black. All over the, all over the network. Was that? Like, Oh! Hey, let me speak. Okay, I don't know what is going on. This game Sorry. is a little glitchy right yeah. now. Alright, wait, wait, wait. I don't want to be removed, PD. Oh, hey, Pass, you Rebecca. Me neither. I don't want to be removed, too. I don't. Um, oh, hey, 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 Percy. I sometimes Sorry. hate being removed. It's so glitchy. I don't know why. I mean, I could always. Oh, because it's the bad. Just the bad boy. Also, um, guys, Whoa. I got a voice. This is my mic. Okay, so, anyways, now, so, well, I would like to anyways, it's back to the, 
the story. No, Black is here. Oh, Black is here. All right, all right, guys, wait, 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 guys, wait, wait, wait. guys. No, what's up? We ain't dealing with him. All right, guys, that's okay. enough. So, oh. Hey, Mark. Oh, well, in my eyes, I don't see that's not the planet I see today because of him. Oh. Yes, I know it's a plan, Mark. Because... Just look, okay? I don't, I don't want to stop. I don't actually want to be a part of this war. I just want peace. So, that's what I'm trying to give you to get rid of Brayden. And I seriously do not I'm want to be in my yeah. wartime colors again. I'm trying to simply keep yeah. everyone safe. That's safe. what I'm trying so, to I do. Said, I'm trying to not do a goddamn yeah. nuclear bomb. Sorry, okay, let, I'm just going to say... All right, all right, everyone, the modernization everyone. plan had come. I'm not doing this no more. Okay. Just forgive me. For, just forgive me, Alex, for what I... Just said. I mean, I honestly. The first of I the mean, when the modernization had come, the K force are, are to be replaced by not type of steam engines, but by diesel engines themselves. Serena, hey, hey Serena, welcome aboard. No, don't kick me out. Don't kick me out. Don't kick me out. Okay, finally, Alex, you stop looking. Stop pushing. Start. Don't. Do not put back the creepy ass Thomas face that I just saw. Please don't do it. So Sorry, guys, I'm about to blow up. All right, all right, all right. No, no, sorry, no, sorry, no, sorry, no, sorry, no. sorry, sorry, sorry. Give me a second. No, no. Okay, okay, okay. Um, <clears throat> Marco, how to put your face because. Hey. 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 Serena, hey, why are you giving me a Long time no see, you guys. Hey, Hello, Serena. Serena. Yeah. Hey, Serena. Yeah. yeah. Uh, also, um, guys, I actually I'm have sorry. some good news. I'm sorry, guys. Bad news. Normally, I have six of them because I don't have enough space. Yeah. Also, um, yeah, yeah that's the problem with the dream yard, isn't Wait, it? Wait, I got an idea. I got an idea. I got an idea. What? How can solve this problem, PD? Oh, my, my God. Stream. Oh my God. Guys, there's something I need to say. So, yeah. What is it? I knew you got some I good news and some bad news, <laughs> actually. What? So, good news is my whole So Fast the Fred's franchise and everything is still around. But the bad news is they're canceled, basically. Because my YouTube channel is lost and my dog just went by me like crazy. And one thing is, though, my YouTube is acting up, so I won't be able to make some videos anymore. And second, if if people keeps on, like, freaking arguing or interrupting me or whatever, I'm about to blow up. <coughs> that face might have been... Yes, I know, I know, I know. I know. So, yeah. Oh, so, oh, boy. Because... I almost choked on nothing. <laughs> um... So, if you guys can actually like gain support on like both me and uh, both me and Alex's channel, we appreciate it. I feel Arvid is selling the worst. And also, oh more cars of the K4 being the bother to the strap cars. But in, the, in 1961, some of the K4 began to rapidly disappear one by one. All the K4 not me, not me, not me. Not me. Oh, hey, Ricardo. None of the cables. Oh, hi, Ricardo. Ricardo's here. here. Yeah, 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 not me. Don't put me in that state. Well, only one cable still exists around here. It is, of course, the Great Marquess. Yep. <clears throat> so what? Well, hold on. Can I please talk on this part? So, I actually saw the Great Marquess in person. Wait, really? Yes, I did, and allow me to explain that. So, um, I went to Bournemouth with my dad not too really? long. Really? I went to Bournemouth uh, not yeah. a long time ago. Um, okay, okay. Um, and, um, I'm trying to talk. So, um, right. the engine, well, yeah. it was in its VR black paint scheme, and it was on display in the museum, and believe me, it looked beautiful. I, I did take a photo, but unfortunately, I cannot find the photo. 
computer anymore, so... I am a about the oh. on my computer. Alright, I am... Alright. So, I'm not... So, yeah, some... But listen, oh, I... Oh, oh, I got an idea. Ricardo, join my stream. Okay, Can guys... Talk on the other end. Guys, I'm seriously about to go crazy on my Steam right now, and my computer is basically being a total idiot or whatever because I can't even click stuff right. It's starting to get me really mad. First P now so fast. But, yeah, none, none of that, Sherlock. Finally. See. <sighs> you see, this is why I can't yeah. deal with computers that much. Also, I'm... Uh, Based for... Oh he no! Just, gosh dang it! Awesome. God guys. damn it! Oh no! Hey Ricardo, you can join my stream. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> hey yo, it's Polar Express. What dad? Polar. <laughs> Nobody knows. Team Fortress Two. Oh. oh. Train with a gun. He's back. He's back. Hey. <laughs> guys, look what Marcus said. Guys, look what look what Marcus said in the private chat. <laughs> he said, "Train with a gun." Train with a blinking gun. Oh my goodness! <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Ricardo needs. Yeah. Yeah, we need to add Ricardo in. Yeah. yeah. Uh, yes, uh, not, not, not it. Not it. Not it. Not it. Okay. No. Okay. Can I please stop it? Can I please talk? Not so, sure. what I'm going to say yeah, here yeah, is... Yeah, yeah, Wendy, Wendy. Some yeah, Wendy, people ahead, here ahead, need to... Ahead. All right. I want everyone no, to sure. listen. Well, all right, yeah. so... Some people are probably going to need to get used to being in the backstage a bit more. I mean, I've been in backstage in a lot of streams, and I've gotten used to it. So, like... I, well, I think so fast should learn, because... I think you should learn as well, Alex. All right, fuck. Fuck well, there's only one reason since I don't want to yeah. be in backstage, though, actually. It's kind of, well, since I'm back, though, recently, why can't I just stay in the stream, though, actually, since, like, since I'm back? Like, the thing is, there, like, we always can't talk to the same person, if you know what I mean. Like, we might want to like, add that, a That's why I, add, I, I made a stream. That's why I made the stream. Oh, right. Why, so, if so fast joins, I can talk on the other end, like, basically, like a Yeah, telephone. true. I guess. So, so join the stream. I am, I am. I'm here. I'm here. Now. I'm here. You haven't seen the great Marquess? It was something stuff in real life. All right, put me in backstage now. Put me in backstage too. No, no, no. Wait, not me. No, 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 not me. Not me. Wait, put, wait, put so fast in backstage. Put me in backstage. Never mind. All right. Hey! Whoa. She's beautiful. That is one gorgeous engine. I know. I remember seeing her not too long. Hey, uh, Peter, I dig your glitchy. Oh, yeah. At least, is, I uh... saw, at least I solved the problem. Okay. Oh, dang it. Yeah. Because I have enough room. Where <laughs> <laughs> is, uh... Yes. Okay. Let's see here. Let's just take a look. There's a great mark right here. Oh, yeah. Wow. Now listen to this beat. Yeah, I see it. 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 Dang. <laughs> Sorry about that. It's okay. Also, guys, oh. uh, guys, guys, may I please talk after yes. the talk is over? Well, um, the, um, well, there's something I would like to show here. It's um, what is it? All right, just just after the video's done, at least. Yeah. Because I want to show everyone something I've been working on. It's not a um a model. It's a creepy pasta, surprisingly enough. Oh God! Oh no, bro, God! It's not. It's not, bro. It's not that scary, really. Yeah. 
Oh, hi, Alex Gardner. Uh, no, you're not late. It's just you're you're in time. Stream's not going to end until like twenty more minutes, I think. Yeah. Oh darn it, Petey's bugging out. Petey, wake up! Wake up! Petey, Petey, Petey's computer got crashed. Oh my gosh! Wake up, Petey! Wake up! Guys, this is all. Oh, guys, this is all I see. All I see on my screen is just the coaches. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, Alex Carter, since the, you can't join, why not join my stream? Then we yeah. can talk on other each other's ends. That's what I'm saying. Well, and he left. Uh, oh, that's, that's one well, way to... Anyways, um, and so there I'm, he goes. Anyway, so should I just um, show, tell my creepy pasta or what the... What the um, just tell the creepy pasta. Well, okay. you have to share your screen though. Actually, I don't know. No, no, like I'm going to be reading it. I'm all reading right. it, so yeah. I don't have to share my screen or anything like that. So, all right, I shall now begin. the um The story is called Disaster at Dunbar. So, uh, again, I was lagging out. I was lagging out again. Uh, PT, I am. I'm going to be telling a creepy pasta to um the others. That's fine. Well, yes, I know, because... Uh, sorry, guys, I don't have enough space because I only add six people. Sorry, but, guys. But don't worry, I saw... People sorry, don't worry, because wait, Petey, I don't have I saw, enough money to have upgrades. Yeah. Sorry. Petey, Petey, I kind of basically that? solved that problem with my stream. Um, yeah. Anyways... So, awesome, guys. I came for illustrated some of these... Uh, Okay, so um, sh what should I? So just yes, like your cable will illustrate some of the worst, greatest Steve locomotives of all time. So yes. 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 yes, 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 yes. Right. Yes, it yes, might, yes, take right. A, might take a wee bit, but um, right. without any more interruptions, let's go. So, as I've said before, it's called Disaster at Dunbar. So, <clears throat> here we go. My name is Rupert Douglas. My name is Rupert Douglas. I'm a former janitor, guard, and engineer for British Railways. The job paid well, so the job wasn't too bad. I would like to share my story with you on what happened. The year is March 12, 1955. I was in my early 20s and decided to get myself a job working for British Railways. I got myself a job working as a janitor for Edinburgh Station, which is one of the main terminals on the East Coast Main Line. I sort of enjoyed it, although it wasn't the best job in the whole world. I later worked my way up to be a guard. I enjoyed waving my green flag as the trains departed the station. In 1957, I soon got a job as, an, as a locomotive engineer, and I was assigned to work on a British Rail Class 15 diesel electric. Sadly, I can't remember the number, though. When I got to drive it, it ran terribly. Whenever I tried to start up the engine, it would always cough and splutter. Therefore, I didn't like British Railways as a company because they were making diesels without testing them. I told my boss about the locomotive. He then reported it to British Railways and, and they took it out of service to fix it up. Eventually, in 1958, I was assigned to work on another engine. This time, it was a steam engine. This particular engine came from the former London and Northeastern Railway. The engine was an LNER A3, painted in British Rail's Brunswick green paint scheme. It had a round dome, a vintage-looking tender with a British Rail crest on it, a late one for that matter. Uh, it had the number 60105 and the name Victor Wilde. As for its performance, it ran as, as smooth as a sailboat. I really enjoyed driving the L. I also got to meet my, I also got to meet my fireman. His name was Duncan Edwardson, and he was from the western, he was from the highland parts of Scotland, but moved to Edinburgh to look for a good job. Me and him later became good friends, and he seemed to like his job very well, although one autumn night in 1960 would forever change my opinion on British Railways forever. On September 16th, 1960, me and Duncan got ready to take the evening sleeper service from Edinburgh to King's Cross, which was all the way down in the south. We made sure the engine had a full tender and a full tank. I had a chat with Duncan in the cab like usual. I asked him, Hey Duncan, do you think this run will go well, as this is pretty much my first time driving the train at night? Duncan said, Okay, I'm sure this run will go fine. I've been working 
for this company since 1948, so I know what to do in case of an emergency. I soon felt better after he said that. The last door on the train slammed shut. The, the guard blew his whistle. I opened the regulator, and the train wheezed out of the station. Ten minutes into the journey, and things were going smoothly, and we passed a couple stations on the way. As we were approaching Dunbar Station, I began to slow the train down to 50 miles an hour. As we were passing over a bridge that was going over a footpath, I felt a loud thump. Worse to come, the sound of ballast crunching and metal crashing could be heard. The train skidded to a halt, nearly touching the platform. Me and Duncan clambered out of the cab and headed to the front of the locomotive. What I saw was the most shocking thing I ever saw in my life. The engine's front pony truck had derailed, and it later caused the body of the locomotive to also derail, making the trailing wheels crunch the ballast. As we looked back, we saw three of the coaches had derailed. One of them was on its side. I was in a state of shock and terror on what I saw. What in the blazes? I said. A couple minutes later, the guard came running over to me and Duncan, wanting to know what the hell was going on. Me and Duncan didn't know, so we decided to go along the train to see if there are any causes of what might have happened. As we walked halfway down the train and onto the bridge, we got the shock of our lives. One of the rails had been bent upwards, pointing towards the foggy sky. We were all in shock when we saw it. Just then, I heard the dreaded sound. I heard the dreaded sound of another engine's whistle. It was a... It was the evening express freight service heading from Newcastle to Edinburgh. We saw the shape of a big engine thundering down the line. Luckily, the train had stopped just in time. That was when I got to see what the engine was. It was a Robinson 04 steam locomotive, which was another former LNER engine that was originally owned by the Great Central Railway. The crew from the engine clambered down from the cab and stared in horror at the derailed sleeper train. I, expl I explained the situation to to them and they were just as shocked as me and duncan at three o'clock in the morning a search party was dispatched outside of york to look for the sleeper train they later found the derailed train at dunbar they soon dispatched a breakdown train and the engine and coaches were taken to the works soon after i went to i went home to my small flat thinking about what had happened so i decided to turn so i decided to think on what might have happened maybe the rails might have warped due to the hot sun from the day prior but then again if there if that were the case my boss would have told everyone something tells me whatever bent that rails was intending to do it from what i heard they they fixed the tracks at the bridge so that was good i kept working for british railways as an engineer although duncan never came back to work after the, after the incident i thought he was taking a break so i just rolled with that i stayed working with the big hunter green engine for many years Although what made me sad was diesel engines were replacing steam engines on the East Coast main line. <gasps> I, kept, I kept working with 60105. I had also met many different people to work alongside me to help. Even though I enjoyed driving my engine, I hated British Railways as a company for not checking their tracks properly and making diesel engines without testing them properly. I knew that modernization plan would fail. And it... Steam engines were being steam engines were being scrapped in favor of diesels. 60105 was one of the engines and that and it was taken out of service in 1963. I eventually quit my job working for BR and I got a job working at a local supermarket not too far from my original from where uh, my original job was. Although one night I heard something on the radio that caught my attention. There was a train derailment and shockingly enough it was at Dunbar. I ran over to the television and turned it on, and surely enough, the news came up. An article read, train wreck at Dunbar, cause unknown. I then saw the footage of a helicopter flying over the derailed train. I got a chance to see what the train was and what it was pulling. The engine pulling the train was a British Rail Class 44 in a British Railways blue paint scheme. I believe it had the number 44007, or something of the sort. It was hauling what appeared to be a passenger train consisting of blue MK1 coaches. The news said it, the news said it had been taking the Aberdonian sleeper service from Newcastle to Aberdeen. From what I saw, the train didn't just derail on the tracks. It full-blown jumped the tracks and tumbled down the hill with some of the coaches following behind. The locomotive itself looked horribly damaged, and all the coaches were crushed. 
I dropped my tea at the sight of the crash. Something was up. No wonder British Rails is losing money, I said to myself. Soon the telephone rang, and I realised it was Duncan. I gave him my number after I met him, and he sounded scared. And that's pretty much the end of the story. So what does everyone think? I want to make an adaptation of that story. Bro, I that give that story well. 10 out of 10. Thank you. Oh, for me, it's a... Well, for me, it's the... It was a very interesting story, but yep. I decided to make a some of these like uh, with the some of the I, with hold on, commercial PT. faces. PT. I doing it. Uh, so yes, uh, yes. So re Ricardo's in back. You can add him in. Okay. Hello. Oh, so, uh, oh, um, hi. Hey, Ricardo. Hey, Ricardo. Um, hello, hello, Ricardo. It's um. All right. What the heck, guys? Look at his profile picture. <laughs> Mountain engine with a gun. So yeah. Oh God. It's Ralph. Yes. It's Ralph from uh, the smoke. Yes. Uh, that's nice. That's the. Mm -hmm. uh, so yes, that's the end of the. Uh, we already talked about the cave balls, and we talk about the uh, the Sasa Dogbot today. So right yep. now, next week on my gang, yes, the great, yes, the greatest passenger train of all time, the London Midland and Scottish Railways Royal Scot. I'm gonna blow my whistle. Ah! Also, she told me. Yes. Next time we talk about the Royal Scots. I also, really want to say something to you know, boy about that story. Yes, because the Royal Scots are the big ascensions around. That. But uh, yeah, I'm not sorry, but the, the, was amazing. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Well, anyway, guys, thanks for watching to our stream. Be sure to comment, rate. Like, share, and subscribe to our channels. Remember, oh, wait. keep yeah. on streaming. We'll see you next also, wait, 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 wait. Also, there's something Bye. you need to say real quick. There's something Bye, you need to everyone. say real quick. Guys, there's something Adios. you need to say real quick. So, wait. So, okay. Well, not on the screen, though, actually. Well, put me in solo mode real quick so I can say this fast, okay? So, people that are out there, please support me and Alex's channel right away, guys. Because I try to get to yes. 500 subs. And I Let's need and I there. and I need to get my videos all at once, guys. Please support both of our videos and steam on. And this is the sound. This is so fast. Forty-four ninety-nine. Signing off. Hi. Bye. Right. Bye, everyone. Okay. Bye. Bye.